My name is Bill Brenton. I'm here today as a citizen of uh, Jacksonville, Duval County, Florida, and I'm a um, supporter of the library straw ballot. Thank you. You're welcome. There are proponents and opponents of the library straw ballot. Please describe the proponents' views. Well, the proponents' views are basically this. Around the state of Florida, there are many uh, great library systems, library districts. One of the best models for a library district in the state of Florida are the models in Alachua County, Florida, and Orange County, Florida. They have independent library taxing districts, and they've been uh, in place now for several decades, and they're very successful. In a recent study by JCCI, Jacksonville Community Council Inc., uh, those two library systems were identified as models that Jacksonville might seek to uh, pursue to have a better library system that operates more efficiently and better serves our community. Uh, the way you have an independent library district is the legislature has to put the issue on the ballot. Uh, the legislature did that for the voters of Alachua County and Orange County a number of years ago. Again, you cannot have an independent district unless the legislature puts the issue on the ballot. The library straw ballot is a vehicle by which we, the citizens of Jacksonville, the voters of Duval County, ask the legislature to put that issue on the ballot for us. Uh, again, we cannot have that vote here in Duval County unless the legislature puts it on the, on the ballot. And so we can't have the rights that the voters in Alachua County and Orange County have unless we have the legislature afford us that right. So this is really uh, the basic uh, democracy uh, in, in the works. We've collected about 30,000 petitions to put this straw ballot issue on the ballot. And if you're against it, what you're really doing is you're saying, we don't want to have that, that right that the voters of Alachua County and Orange County have. We're, you know, we're not deserving. I believe, as a longtime resident of Jacksonville, that we here in Duval County should have the opportunity that was afforded to uh, the citizens and the voters of Orange County and Alachua County to have the right to have an independent district. Um, an independent district for us would mean a better system. Uh, we would have long-term planning, which we don't have today. It surprises some people that library fines go back into the city's general fund, which uh, strikes most people as being highly unusual and, and quite shocking. As I drove here uh, to this afternoon, I realized that uh, 16 of our 21 libraries are closed today. The five that are open are only open for, five, for four hours today. Tomorrow, most libraries are closed. We do not have an efficient system here in Duval County. We don't have long-term planning. We have a what many consider to be a broken system. So this is an opportunity for Duval voters to say to the legislature, we would like to have that same opportunity that you gave to the voters of Alachua and Orange County, and we're deserving of that choice. And that would be probably in 2016 would be the earliest time this issue would be on the ballot for real. So please support the library straw ballot uh, when you consider this issue either at the polls, early voting, or by um, um, absentee ballots. Thank you very much.